welcome to career growth in today's episode i'll be talking about civil engineering as a career for studying abroad What is the first thing that comes to your mind when you have been advised to take up civil engineering as a career? What is civil engineering and what do the civil engineers do? Civil engineering is about creating, designing, improvising and maintaining and the construction of building and infrastructure such as railways, roads, power plants, airports, etc. The civil engineers work with the state or the local government or in the private sector at consulting or construction firms and are responsible for design of world's most inspiring buildings, bridges, roads and incredible structures in the world. Now, let's talk about few related options for civil engineering. Some of them are bridge engineering, structural engineering, transport engineering, civil and water engineering and also building engineering. Let's know some of the industry options for civil engineering. You have bridge constructions, airports, environment, railways, tunnel. Now let's talk about few of the related options mentioned above and what do they mean. The first one bridge engineering. The bridge engineers create bonding between the disconnected parts of the country, two banks of the oceans, rivers, etc. The next one is structural engineering. Structural engineering is concerned with the design and analysis of the buildings, towers, tunnels, etc. They are the experts when it comes to the technical problems throughout the constructions, projects, designing structures to fulfill the purpose of the project. The third one is transportation engineering. Transportation engineers plan, design and help facilitate any mode of transportation in order to provide environmental and safe movement of goods and people. The next one would be civil and water engineering. Civil and water engineers maintain, repair, build structures to control water resources. It also focuses on the supply, irrigation and the disposal. The fifth one would be the building engineering. Building engineers are responsible for the construction, maintenance, design and renovations of the buildings. Now, I would like to tell you about the application process to apply to the various universities for these courses. First and foremost, students will have to fill in an application form. It can be an online application form or you may have to download a hard copy form, fill it and courier it to the university respectively. You may need your documents like transcripts, which is an official transcripts from your school, college respectively, the bachelor's degree from where you have taken. You may need the test scores of your TOEFL, IELTS, GRE, depending on the country of your choice, where you're planning to apply. In the previous episodes, we have discussed regarding each and every entrance exams that are required for most of the countries. You need reference letters. You may have to keep at least two academic reference letters and one can be a work experience uh, reference letter if you have some work experience or it can be academic reference letters as well. You may need your statement of purpose that is also called as SOP. You also need to have a resume which in short will talk about your personal details, your academic details, your projects done, your assignments done and anything that can add value to your application. Each and every university will have a specific application deadlines. We should make sure that the applications are submitted well on time to avoid any last minute issues. I hope you have enjoyed watching this episode. Keep watching Career Growth and keep subscribing on our channel Career Growth. Thank you.